Interface initiated. Loud and fatal. That's what our employer wants from us. All right, let's do this. Welcome back to BattleTech. And today, what's that? I see a little locust. There will likely be reinforcements. I'm let's sure there will be. Fighting. Oh, someone's eager. Very good. I'm walking here. Let's get moving. So we've got me out here. Your co your beloved Commander Chimpy is on the field. So rejoice. We're all going to be safe yeah, now. Now this is a horrible looking landscape. Looks like it's going to be terrible for heat generation. Look, we may want to try and take the higher ground if possible. Let's continue sort of moving around this way. Moving to position. What is this? Radiation field. Adds, f adds heat to units passing through. Plus four difficulty to hit. Plus ten heat for two activations to units passing through the radiation field. Let's just avoid it, shall we? Copy that, Commander. Just kind of just go over top. Oh wow! Look at that heat generation. That is that is not nice. Moving to position. Oh, that's going to activate them. All right. So something I never explained is the initiative phase. Ah, oh, crap! Really? It's running us on our right, are they? Very well. So, up here you can see light mechs go first. They're in the four initiative phase. It's possible to get boosted up, by the way. That's why there's a five here. Mediums, heavies, assaults. I never actually took the time to explain that, in case you're unfamiliar. But that's why people go when they go. Uh, Receiving you. Yeah. So, anyway. Shall we take a look here? Difficult. Ooh. So it's more difficult to hit us if they're uh, if we're down here, up here, over here. All right, what is that? Little locust. Pathetic little locust. On. Just want to remove some evasion. Report negative damage. Picked up a blip. Got to be careful we don't get LRMs in the back. That could be a little bit of an issue, you see. You got it. Right, you two up here. Oi. These are not such great shots, are they? Tell you what, let's just take one shot of the Ooh, spoon. You are a natural with that large laser. Very good. Over here, fortunately, there isn't much we can do here other than Jump up here for the Vindicator. I'd say avoid using any of the medium lasers and just go for that large one. Target acquired. That's a miss. Not to worry, Meerkat. Negative damage. Alright, and here I am. I'm the Centurion. Hmm. Maybe I'm better off just using the LRM-10. See how it goes. Going for my wee commando. Ready Fair to enough. I'm Up there. you go. Oh, you can't see him. Huh. What's up, boss? Where are they? They're over here. They are. They're quite far behind. Not too worried then. I don't know if there's anything else about here though. Location confirmed. Double misses. Not so good. I'm your spaniel. All right. Rolling. With the vindicator in a little bit. Again, not looking at the most amazing shots, but I think we'll take just a couple of these. The large laser should hit. Nice. Took out the right leg. Doesn't appear there's going to be a lot of loot, <laughs> it would seem. Alright. They should be fairly straightforward to hit. 
eight, so I don't think we need to use the AC again. I think two LRM hits will do it, so... Let's get rid of one of the lasers as well. Alright, good. So that was the reinforcements, that one locust. Damn, we're gonna do this right. Okay. No problem. No problem at all. And there it is. Roger. Is that another locust? Is that it? Copy that. I feel like it is. Skipper. I'm rolling. <laughs> all right, Spoon. Let's go. Affirmative. <laughs> Pinpoint precision, right in the knee. Used to be a mech warrior, then I took a laser to the knee. Onward. Uh, yeah, this Martian terrain is pretty unforgiving, isn't it? Might as well take the lot. There it goes. Tango down. Wow. Mission successful. Is that it? Was that actually it? So clearly, if you go for salvage, you get less enemies. <laughs> Cause that was pathetic. Um, there's not even any like. Look, there's there's nothing here to take. It's. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get it all. I mean, a bit of a waste. Uh, but you know what? We took no injuries, so that's fine. And we got a little bit of easy experience, so whatever. It's a free mission. <laughs> Maybe we test the theory out again and go for a one and a half star mission. Skull mission, sorry. Uh, I just don't want to do any of the ones that are, that are there. I think it might be time to move on to the next territory. Hmm. Does anything need a repair? Surely not. No. Yeah, we're repairing the Vulcan now. Because we're upgrading it. Okay. So, that's in five days. I do want to upgrade the Centurion to be an LRM boat. I do like that AC-10 though. Oh, do I like that AC-10. Is it possible to get rid of this and add... No, that's just being greedy. And add another one, but I don't think it is. We kind of have to go out with it all. I could rather keep it out, out of the way. And instead just go nuts on the... LRMs. Got a 15 here. That's about it. So it can take it up to like 30. New weapon systems available. Alright, let's go to you. Throw you in here. All right, 44. Put the medium laser back in. Particularly, you could have this, couldn't you? <laughs> that would be rubbish. That would be absolutely rubbish. Uh, yeah, this works. Max out the armor, as always. Mac, uh, lower a lot of the rear armor. There we go. Second medium laser. There we go. So if anything gets too close, we can poke him with that a little bit. All right. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. All right. Good. See that you do. All right. Let's accept the contract. This one here. Want to test the theory on again? That's a lot of money. 
Still gonna test it out. Capturing a base. Hmm. Hmm. We don't have that last one quite well. Calculating course now, Commander. All right, let's move. All right, let's go. See if anything happens along the way. You do get these little things come up, these little uh, events, like usually the mech warriors get up to hijinks. Okay, Innisfear politics impact everything they touch, even down here in the periphery. Flashpoints between great houses are developing all over the map, and our faction reps are paying good money to resolve them. We're talking about high risk, high reward jobs, composed of multiple combat drops with rewards at the end to match. I'll post any active flashpoints on the star map, Commander. You can review them when you're ready. So, that is also one of the DLCs, is flashpoints. And it looks like we have a couple here of unknown origin. I will probably look these up in advance. So what have we got? Consecutive employments, no. Engagement length, medium. <coughs> the Dragonus combine is who we would do this for. Tonnage requirements, heavy. So you see, we're clearly under uh, equipped to deal with any of these. Tonnage requirements, no restriction. Consecutive deployments, yes. Bone to reward. So this looks like a little bit, like it's a little bit easier. Two and a half. That's a two. One and a half up here. Hello. Expires in 300 days. You get a rare mech. Ooh. Engagement length long. Oh wow. 300 days. Okay. Well, we've got plenty of time before these go and expire. And we need to go ahead and get going. Okay. Complete, Good stuff. Not work, if I may say so. Two days. We only get the Centurion back in four days, so we still need to wait four days. We really need to improve our mech bay, I think. Uh, not yet. So, speaking of which, ship upgrade is how we can do that. So, as you see down here, the mech bay, we can upgrade to mech another whole section of the mech bay. Increase the monthly cost by 25,000. It costs a lot, as you can see, but you get you can keep more mechs plus three tech points as well. It's pretty good. Um, I do think these might be the way to go for now, though. Just smaller upgrades, automation, refit harness, repair scaffolding. That sort of stuff might be more useful. We've got a bit of recreation lounge just to increase morale as well as an option. We've got one day until the financial reports in. So let's have a little look at that. Oh, uh, annoyed, Darius calls you on the comms. Commander, I'm going to need you over the corridor between the barracks and the mess. I caught Meerkat painting my likeness on the bulkheads and I'm not amused. <laughs> In the corridor, Meerkat stands to the mural, clutching an airbrush. Behind him, the XO is depicted flexing his shirtless, rippling biceps and abs while flames erupt behind him. What's going on here, Meerkat, you ask? Everyone hates this stretch. It's so cold and grey, so I decided to turn up the heat. Meerkat grins. You know, some members of this crew really, really like it. <laughs> and I'm going to have to continue in an, in an authorised area. That seems like the only way to really go about this. <laughs> it's a bit harsh. <laughs> uh -huh, you rub your chin smiling, <laughs> Mecoria. You've got talent, so I'll make you a deal. Clean this up and you can keep working. Out of an unused cargo hold. Mirkat's face lights up in surprise. Really? I've got a new piece I've been working on. I call it Mega Yang. Then hop on it. That's the, Yang is the uh, the mech bay bloke, by the way. Uh, Mirkat's face lights up. Uh, then hop to it, you say. Let's put a grand opening together. In a couple of days, your crew gathers. The crew gathers in makeshift gallery for several painted across the bulkheads. Yang leaps wildly encased in blue armor. His cybernetic arm is transformed into autocannon blasting an unforced an unseen foe, 
while the crew excitedly crowds around him, Dara slides up to you. I hate to say it, but I kind of wish we'd kept my moral. He crosses his arms, and you realise the XO is wearing a sleeveless vest for the first time. You realize, oh yeah? He scowls, what is it? It's warm in here. Um, <laughs> sorry, Meerkat has lost the tag Rebellious. Uh, we've also gained morale by one, and Meerkat is, is in high spirits for 14 days. So that is useful, by the way. Uh, he has high morale and will be able to use inspiration abilities more often in battle. So that's the, you know, the cover ability um, to increase his defense of abilities, basically. So that's really nice. And he's already in that Vindicator, so he's going to be an absolute tank in it. Uh, but yeah, the increased morale is really nice. All in all, that, that came out pretty good. So here's our costs so far. We have these here. Um, we've got the repaired power conduits now. Uh, we've got our mech warrior costs over there. Current funds are a million. I think we can push the boat out to be generous just to continue increasing morale early on here, just in case something gets in the way. I mean, it only gets more expensive later on to do it, so better off doing it early, in my opinion. I might be completely wrong on this, and everyone might be going, no, this is not how you do it, but that's just my mindset. We can earn money doing contracts, all right? So let's take a look at what dreaded contracts there are here. I'm hoping there's a few one skull ones. About. Oh, there are quite a few, actually. But they're all government ones, apart from you. Ambush or convoy. I don't like those missions. To be honest with you. Uh, right, three days. Job right, there we done, go. Commander. Good stuff. I guess we should go ahead and launch the contract. So, once again, it's going to be us four. We've got Meerkat. He's got a little high spirits bonus. So I think it's basically cheaper for him to use stuff, if I'm not mistaken. Now we may want to go take off the spider and bring in the Vulcan, but I'm actually going to leave it as it is for now. We've got a pretty good thing going on, but obviously we've got to be careful with our Centurion here. Uh, we're fighting in jungle. So it, uh, hotter than comfortable temperatures for the average human, so it is a little bit hotter. Uh, but I'm hoping there'll be pockets of water about. Um, yeah. Let's give it a go. Command interface initiated. Alright, here we are. It's raining. There, um, yeah, I think there might be turrets there, possibly. I'm here. I'm your spaniel. I can see these like solar panels. Kind of look like it, don't they? They're little antennas. Oh, I'm busy destroying everything. Ready for orders. I mean, how close can we get here? All right, should get a good view of the facility now. Be careful of any additional forces. Reports that they have additional units in the area. Expect contact. Word of warning, we have reports that this base may have a gun emplacement for point defense. Just keep an eye out. Oh, well, there we go. We can see. There, yeah, yeah, there it is. It's probably what we want to get rid of. All right. Confirmed. We're in the trees. All right, my turn. I don't see anything else. Uh, yep. Yeah, Commander. Let's just reserve. I got you. Okay, so everyone's available in the same turn here. Confirmed. Let's move. Roger that, Commander. Commando out here. Oh, hello. Another turret there. All Go. Okay. I'm your spaniel. And then we can finish this off. Possibly with you. Or we have our little spider in. I think you might be able to get this actually. Hey. One down. Turret destroyed. I will be done. Go 
confirmed. Yeah, there's a bunch more by them. Let's hold up. Alright, sprint down. No sign of anything else. Interesting. Good to go. Right, these are more like light shredder turrets, I believe. Fire in all weapons. What are your orders, Skipper? I imagine. Got a little action. commando here. Spoon. Probably take him out. There it is. Easy. I'm receiving you. Making it far too easy for me. I want to keep that mobility up. Okay. I've got eyes Something's on the map. Right, where was that? Over there. Okay. Ready to rock. <clears throat> I think what we want to do here then. Reserve a turn. Uh kind of getting surrounded here. Yes, Commander. Might want to see if we can just sneak in here. So it's three lights and one medium. Right, I think you can uh, take the shot here. Right, one down. Just means we don't get flanked by these turrets, because I think they have... If it was if this was XCOM, they have squad sight, is what I'm trying to say. Hmm. Okay, let's keep moving. Yeah, this should be easy peasy. Yeah, that's a lot of firepower. Target destroyed. Good. Confirmed. So over here. I think all we want to do is sprint. Alright, let's move. Keep that mobility up. Let's there we move. go. Let's reserve, so we can tell everybody to wait, our lightest mechs to wait for the next turn. Best way to go. Okay, once again we're going to reserve, wait for that medium mech to move. There's our choice salvage of the mission. Alright, I think we kind of want to start. Hey, up we need. This is one steep hill. Receiving you. I mean, I don't really know what I want to do here. Understood. Moving fast. I guess this. Waiting for orders. Let's just sprint. Again, stay in cover. They're going to have aim bonuses, which is a little bit annoying. Not, really, not much I can really do about that. You can actually see them from there. This gives us a chance to dissipate some heat, which is actually quite good. Alright, I think we're going to move you over here. Alright, Spoon, you're good. Really need to give you more armor, I think. I've been saying that for a long time now. Okay. Who was that? Was that a heavy? There's a fire starter. There you go, missing.
Oh, we. That's a commando. Based on the large laser, medium laser combo. I live to serve. Alright, let's go. Yeah, there it is. It might be worth going to all of them. Alpha Strike. <laughs> oh, it's a blackjack. Damn. These things have guns. It's okay, though. We've got armor. And we've got damage reduction. So that's kind of our priority. I think it's safe to say. Right, our Centurion here. I mean, these things do generate... They generate a lot of heat. So, is that what we actually want to go for? Maybe. I'd be nice to get rid of this Commando, because they are crafty. Right, let's launch 30 rockets at you. You lost your right arm. That's your large laser. So that renders you borderline useless. I must admit, I'm quite pleased by that. Okay. Continuing to move amongst the trees, let's... Yeah, I guess let's do this, right? Alright, let's go. Blackjacks aren't particularly heavily armoured. They're armoured enough. Move the spider down here. And uh, you might as well start shooting. Oh, there goes the right torso. Nice. It's just a bit of damage. And our commander's just going to keep moving back and forth like this. Structure exposed already on it. Good. Okay, nice. Waiting for orders. Move you across. Mm. Yeah, let's do it. Ah, never mind. Report negative damage. All right, fire starter and a panther is the one at the back. That thing's got a PPC, so it's going to hit hard. But it is going to generate a lot of heat. Alright, the fire star. I know what you're going to do. Ah! Critical heat. Heat's frying my internals. Rolling. Alright, we are going to have to go ahead and... Because you're not going to have the evasion that you're used to having. Definitely going to have to do that. Bring a few of these lasers offline. Got two of them. Still on. Okay. Oh, it's all right. Really managed to reduce the damage, though. So far, so good. All right. Can we? Do yeah, let's do this. Go, go, go. All right, we're softening the blackjack up, but it is tough. I don't know if that hit or not. I don't think it did because that would blow through your structure. I'm ready. Right, meerkat. We're going to continue to, because you've got high spirits, we're going to capitalize on that. So it's cheaper for you to use abilities like that. We can now bring in the lasers again. Left torso destroyed. Nice. There goes one of those ACs. Those auto cannons are gone. Oh, no. Oh. Heavy structural damage there. I'm there. Keep moving the commando. Well, 
Right, he's unsteady now. The Vindicate has taken a beating. But it's doing good. It's doing a really good job, actually. Uh, here. This might be the best option. Not using the jetpack. Come in here nicely. There we go. Firing. That was good. Oh. Glad I went full armor. <laughs> okay. I think this is the way to go. Can we get in a bit closer? Possibly. Makes you a target as well, and then we can use the lasers as well. One of them hit. Center torso destroyed, pilot incapacitated. There it is. Right, there goes the uh, backbone of their operation. Holy crap, the left arm destroyed. That means we just lost a couple of medium lasers. Right, the panther's got to go. Panther has to go. Ah, uh, it's going to be a shutdown on the Vindicator. That, he critical, Commander. Okay, we're ready to go. Right, we've managed to restart it, but they are just ganging up on the Vindicator right now. Minimal damage on that hit. Standing by. Helping. Ah, uh, come on. Ah. I need use like one laser on him. Affirmative. Well, it's something. There, yeah, you're too close, so let's move you back. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. Alright. Here we go. Yes, that's it. Go for the little guys. Skipper. I'm just going to keep doing the same thing that we've been doing every turn with the commando. <laughs> Look, it's working, right? Locking off. All Missed with the large laser there, Spoon, that time. That's a shame. Heat sink destroyed. Getting my ass kicked. Uh, Commander? <laughs> yeah, it's not a good look. Won't lie. And we can go like here, but this doesn't help us though. That's the thing. Okay. I think that was really a good idea. The PPC is on the right hand side of it. Really need a turn of this Vindicator. Reporting internal damage. Finally. We can move it, but as you see we don't have two of those medium weapons now. So I want to twist so we're facing sort of the right hand side, the weak side is... Oh wow, that's about to go. Look at that. Eesh. Locking target. SRM gone, left torso destroyed. Critical hit. Still has that PPC though, which I'm not thrilled about. But whatever, let's just see what we can do here. Take off one of the... yeah, let's go with this. Right, a heat sink destroyed, but... Seems to be sinking that heat from the PPC really well. It doesn't actually matter. Uh, oh, you're in my spot. Affirmative, Commander. I'm on him. Ooh. 
head hit. Yeah, Commander. That's something. Small border received. Did you go all Canadian there? All right, maybe you can get the kill. Come on. Engage. PPC gone, and the whole thing destroyed. Nice. Tango down. Oi. Right. Now he's a fire starter, a twisted fire starter, and a highly damaged commando. All right. Do we have here? Right, let's go for the kill. Done. Oh, hell yeah. Target eliminated. Okay, good stuff. Right, lasers offline. Just the rockets, please. Oh, leave him alone. That's an injury for me, a cat. Ready to rock. All right, that's that's enough. I've had enough of you. Now let's see how you handle this. What's up, boss? On my way. Don't think we need too much worry. Don't we need to worry too much, sorry, about how much damage he does. We just need to get rid of those evasion pips. Waiting for orders. And actually come in and see if we can kill it. Locked on for physical attack. Alright, good. You can do it as well. Let's go. Right arm destroyed. That's fine. Go right ahead. Knock yourself out. Damage minimal. Uh, yep. Should we just have everybody come in a melee? Probably not you, Spoon. That's actually uh We know what you're best at. Acknowledge, Commander. And it's shooting. Here we go. Although all that evasion does not help. Receiving you. You know what? It's not a lot of damage. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Vindicator cannot get close enough. Okay. And you're just gonna take some shots. And in fact, you're gonna use Vigilance because... Really can't afford you taking any more damage. Alright, let's go. There we go, left torso destroyed. Enemy mech. Critical damage. And a knockdown, that should be it. No, you've got you've got a bit, little bit a few extra guts. Okay then. Did you miss? He's lying on the ground. How did you miss? How the hell did he do that? <laughs> Mind. You got it. There it is. Alright. Hey, that was uh that was pretty nasty. We did get some nice loot though. I will say that. Oh wait, we need to actually capture the base. Ready to rock. Uh, what have we got? There we go. Sure, you can go there as well. Okay, there we go. I think the magistrate ma magistracy will be pleased with the results. Oh, I've really forgotten how to read today. Okay, good job. That was really unfortunate. So now you're going to have a look at the mech bay whenever we have to, uh, yeah, when we've got injuries. Pretty nasty, as you see here. We've got to replace all these heat sinks and the medium lasers. Uh, it's probably still worth it. We've got that blackjack part. They, they, they can be kind of good, I will say. Kind of good. Uh, 
We're going to get a bunch of stuff here, loads of jump jets and heat sinks to replace what we lost, so that's something as well. We do need those medium lasers. A fire starter, yes. We'll take that as well, there we go. And we got all the other stuff there, great. So all in all, not too horrific. Could have gone worse. Uh, so there we go, that was a one and a half skull mission, we managed to take it on. And that was going through high salvage. Thank you. Alright. Should we take a little look now? The base. So what might be a deadly combination is using a fire starter. Once we get this thing kitted out. And a Vulcan. Kind of in Tamden with all the miniguns. We give them all miniguns, we can just headshot all the mechs that we come across here. Uh, so we can't actually go straight for repairs, we've actually got to refit the mech. So this had heat sinks in it and medium lasers, so we need to replace. How long does it take? Seven days, a hundred thousand, oi. Okay. Right, well. Equipment. We've only got... we don't have all the heat sinks, unfortunately. We're... We literally don't have any more. Might need to buy a heat sink then. Would... Would have rather gone for a heat bank. What the hell is this? X1 AP equipment. Oh, this is massive. Area sensor lock. Oh wow, that's what it is. Holy God, that's really specific, but really interesting. Jeez. Uh, right, what weapons do you have here? You've got PPCs, you've got LRM-10. A snub PPC, you say? Well... It's a bit lighter than a regular. A lot smaller. This uses up a lot less heat. 34... Oh, it doesn't use up a lot less, just a bit, but... 15 times 5. Hmm, is that better? I debate whether or not that is actually better. 5 times 5 stability. Actually, that is better. What am I on about? That is better. Damage. Yeah, that's like 75 damage. Sorry, my math was really off there. But uh, maybe we actually want to go back to, uh, to this for our Vindicator. It's not a bad idea. Uh, I thought I bought the heat sink. go. I think that's fine. 13 days. 14. Everything needs to be repaired. 17 days. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. Hmm. So what we can do is potentially go in with these. Which could be a bit risky. We're also meerkats out for 46 days. Big Red's back in four. Maybe if we take on an easy contract? Like, what's this about? Ambush a convoy. To be honest, with the lighter... Lighter squad, it might be a pretty good idea, actually. I'm quite liking this area to do missions, as well. Recovery in the lowlands. Ah, right! Now this is interesting. I have an awesome idea for a mission type. Uh, for a mission strategy, and I've done it once before in my campaign. So you see the different types of missions we've got here. Destroy base, recovery, ambush convoy, another recovery over here. Oh. In, to, to Detroit? Oh god no, even in space it sucks. Uh, this one here, right, recovery. You basically just need to run to a particular spot, get to that spot, and then go straight away. Like, seriously, it's it's that simple. That straightforward. <clears throat> so, what I want to do is go solo. Seriously, I want to go solo. <laughs> with the spider, and that's it. That's what we do, we just send the spider in on its own. Uh, should be low damage enemies as well, if it's only... I did this with like three skulls, on like a three skull recovery mission, so the enemies were... There are a lot more of them, and we basically just go full... Uh, yeah, we just go full money on it. So it's basically 205,000 in the bank, just like that. 
So I really want to do that as a mission. Um, I also think we're going to do one of the other missions here, like robbery, although that is quite difficult. This one here, witness tampering, hell yeah. Uh, that sounds like a good mission. <laughs> sounds like my kind of thing. And we probably do that with the Centurion, the Vulcan, the Commando, and the Spider. And it's an ambush convoy mission. If we go high on the salvage on that, that will hopefully lower the chances there of being something that isn't a vehicle. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's it's risky. These guys ain't amazing. We also need to kit out this. This puppy right here. So, max armor. We go all jump jets. And that leaves three and a half for flamers? Let's say miniguns. Okay, let's say you had a minigun then, but, you know. Yeah, I mean, if we buy a bunch of miniguns. Check the store. What have you got? Just the basics, don't you? Really hoping for some plus weapons there. New weapon systems available. It's the only one you have. Ah. Oh, you only have the one point. Okay, right, yeah. Uh, you've got two in the torso here. Okay, right. Yeah. You know what? That's fine, though. Your heat efficiency is still stupidly high. You don't need anything else. You just need more weapons, really. You can... Wait, you can take... an LBX. Or something like that. Tonnage of five. Seems a bit... of a crazy thing to do. Give it an auto cannon. Don't think that's necessary. Can always give it a laser. I quite like the idea of making it a pure, a pure play. So we're going to hold off on that. Leave it there for now, but I might be doing... I think I'm definitely going to be doing that recovery mission next. So you're going to see me with the spider getting in there. Don't know who's going to go yet. I'm thinking Spoon because we can get some alliteration going. Uh, we can actually, you know, go with Spoon solo... Uh, I forgot what I was going to call it now. I don't know, can't remember what I was going to call it. Honestly, drawn a blank. But this is what we do go pure money. Pure cash money. Out, out, out. And yeah, let's say we did something like this. Go for Spoon, he's got the higher guts. In fact, if he can train for Bulwark now, that reduces the damage he takes. He still can't, can yeah, anybody? Nice. Not quite, but you can get target uh, lock. That's good. Sensor lock. Good to go. Ready for orders. Meerkat. Hmm. Yep. Kind of a shame. Good to go. Orders. Hmm. Never mind. Either way, next time it's definitely going to be a solo mission. I think it's going to be quite, quite a lot of fun actually. Uh, so, yeah, let's see if it works again for me. I really hope so. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.